Now this might seem a silly question, but how do you hold your camera? Now, a lot of people will use this display. I've seen it so much and it kind of frustrates me. Um, and you can have this out with your display on the back. So I'm looking here at the back here and, and I'm holding it and I'm pointing and I've really not got a lot of chance of holding this very steady, uh, even with it, we, even with the display folded back in and I'm out here looking at the picture, it's not good, it's not stable, it's not the way we're taught to take it, photos with it. Now, you do have a viewfinder at the top. Personally, I would be flicking the display button off. I don't want this display on. Let that disappear. And I would get into almost a position as if you were holding a gun here, yeah? I'm gonna use my front hand and tuck this in. And this is what's gonna hold, take the weight of my camera and my lens. Um, this hand really is, is, is here to press buttons, but it isn't really taking the weight. Um, and I tend to lean in. It's a, you know, almost a bit of a karate stance or something. I've got my weight on my front foot, not my back. I've made this little, this firm position straight up here. I can hold my camera on here and I'm looking through the back and I can hold that, in fact, if I pull my arms right in nice and tight, I can hold that very steady, okay? And why do we want to hold it steady? Because we want to get good, sharp photos. So let me hold it from the side. There is another tutorial on this on the slrcoaching.com website, but I'm just showing you this now. This is your new camera. Okay, I'm holding it to the side here. But all I'm doing is I'm just putting everything in and even as I'm resting this on my forehead and looking through and taking a nice slow breath or hold your breath even better and take your photo. Okay, from this side exactly the same thing, holding it and through I go. Okay, so it's all about getting your shoulders in, hold it in nice and tight to you. This hand is wrapped around my lens. I can zoom in and out nicely. And this one is actually, it's in place for all the main buttons. Everything I need is right where I need this, where I've got my finger and thumb here. Um, so get used to that and you'll make a difference straight away to the sharpness of your photos if you can hold it well, hold it right.